to the Abjami Summit 2016 finals in Hong Kong. So can we call on our first uh, presenter? Tell us more about this lazy home system. Okay. Uh, this is our app. Basically, this is a device. You download the app, you click on it on, through Wi Fi, you turn this on and off. So uh, you can uh, try the basketball game and then sit down, be in a basket, and then catch the ball. This is an Oculus, Oculus DK2. headset. So it's, yeah. we have an Oculus headset here. Um, development kit. Development kit, yes. Minecraft? Yeah, yes. Okay, yeah. tell us a bit more. Um, you can set the room size and the door width, and you can uh, rotate that door. Uh -huh. and then you... This is a chance to be at the MIT. It is a fully sponsored trip to Boston, US. Okay, and the winner. fun to do and it's cool. Really cool, you get to meet new people. Really cool, really fun and you get to make new friends. It was fun and challenging but that's the part of a competition. Uh, I'm really happy that I get to present my ideas to a lot of people. Um, it's just really fun and I learned a lot of things such as like I learned more about coding. That was really fun getting to see the other team's ads and getting to know them. Yeah. It was really fun, it was really intense but it was worth it. Um, I thought it was a really great experience. I got to meet a lot of new people and present ideas. I uh, voted for the, um, the food app. I thought that was a great idea. Um, um, the reason why is because uh, there's tons of food wastage around the world and the supermarkets and they throw away millions of food every day. Why waste food? You can actually get the app to check out the expiry date and with the expiry date you can check out um, not to how to waste food, you can be more efficient and um, yeah I think it's a really good app so I voted that. Mindful Kitchen was the first one, um, the second one was the, uh, I think it was the Food Net, Food Net. The Food Net apps allow you to uh, get together as a family and uh, allows you to pick the recipes and the, the food types that you want and then it will locate the, the Google, using Google API to check out the map and go to the nearest supermarket to get all your ingredients. Um, also there's a medicine part as well, so for example you can go to the pharmacies, uh, local pharmacies to pick up the medicine. And I think one of the future improvements was to integrate the medicine and the food app so that, you know, for example, if I have an allergy or if you're on medicine, you can actually avoid the foods that are, you know, um, maybe out of a conflict. These kids are, are amazing. They, they use this app, the, the platform. I think it's a, a, the, the MIT um, clock uh, app, isn't it? So the development program. So it's really good how they use this uh, um, concept and this tool to create these apps. And remember, these are kids. So these are the future. So amazing. I think the app jamming is doing a really great job of uh, encouraging kids to group, create these apps. And uh, yeah, it's great. These are the future programmers and hopefully with the, you guys, youngsters creating these creative apps, we want to see more and hopefully everyone will get to know your apps on a bigger, grander scale. So as once again, three, two, one. <laughs>